The DaVinci Mini Wireless 3D Printer is a budget-oriented, uniquely designed piece of tech that's oriented towards newcomers and casual consumers. So if you find yourself in this category, stick with us in the next couple of minutes to find out what makes this 3D printer so special. Design-wise, with its bright orange plastic case, the DaVinci Mini definitely stands out from the crowd of black printers. Additionally, the case covers the workings of the printer, but the print bed and hot extruder are still open to the world. A cheap fold-it-yourself plastic cover is composed, however this probably won't stop curious fingers for too long, so some caution is needed for younger users. To continue, at the bottom of the open space in the middle of the Mini is the print bed, a 6x6-inch aluminium slab covered with a sheet of tape that the PLA print material sticks to. For your information, this sheet can be easily swapped out if it's damaged while removing a print, while the Mini ships with three of these. This print bed allows the DaVinci Mini to build prints up to 59 by 59 by 59 inches or a little more than 205 cubic inches. Now for this price range, and for a printer this small, that's still a good size. But there is one caveat. Since there's no heating on the print bed, larger prints may not always stay stuck to the bed. When it comes to the controls, well, the DaVinci Mini has no controls on the printer itself. Instead, everything's located in the XYZWare program, available as a free download for Windows and Mac. To be more specific, this program is straightforward and simple to use, presenting you with a rotatable preview of the 3D model. You can scale, shift, or load multiple models to print at once, but you can't edit the models. For your safe insurance, the DaVinci Mini works only with PLA filament from XYZ, so if you try to install a reel of third-party filament without one of the NFC tags that accompanies a reel of XYZ's own filament, the printer will refuse to accept it. As well as authorizing the filament for use, these tags contain the color of the filament, plus a running total of the amount used. To conclude, if you're looking for a budget 3D printer that performs and looks premium, then this could be your ideal choice.